Aloha, you got duck season! One day rental, so make the most of it. Oh, I will! In this video, I'm going to show you all seven endings to the game Duck Season, and I'm going to show you how to get each ending for yourself, whether you're playing the VR or the non-VR version. We're going to start with the ending that I got first, the Canon ending. To start with, go through this game as most people typically would. Just go from level to level in the game, shooting as many ducks as you can, but occasionally, just once in a while, shoot the dog. Maybe even shoot the dog more times than you need to. Just keep on going through the levels as best you can, ignoring the fact that a knife has gone missing. Honey, how do you see the knife? And ignore the news report. The mystery behind the disappearance of several families in the Tri-County area continues to grow. If you're playing level 8 and you manage to get to round 4 of 3, spin around and see if there's someone watching you play the game. If there is, you're on the right track. Unfortunately, when you were engrossed in the game, your mother was killed. Check back on duck season though, because we're going to have to play one final level. This time, shoot the dog as much as you can, and also shoot the ducks which occasionally will try and fly into the screen. If you shoot him enough before the screen breaks, you'll be on stage 2 of the boss fight. This much larger dog has a much more devastating attack with its laser eyes, so make sure you shoot at the eyes specifically to stop him from doing that. If you defeat that version of the dog and the screen is still intact, you've done well, and you're still on the right path. When you come back to the real world, you're actually still in danger. If you can, grab the flashlight next to you to light up the area and see a little better. Now the dog is going to try and come in and kill you, and he can come at you from various directions, so just keep spinning around until you find out exactly which entrance he's coming through. When you see him, shoot him, or use any of the other available weapons. If you kill him in the living room, that's it. You've got the canon ending. Not a very nice end to the story, so let's see if we can get one that's a little better. This time we're going for the dead ending. For this one, do everything that you needed to do to get the canon ending, only when you see him in the living room, don't fight back. so maybe that wasn't too nice either. But let's go for another one. Number three is Stuck Forever. Again, following the same pattern of going through the levels, shooting the ducks and shooting the dog, get to the final level in the boss fight and let him destroy the screen.
Huh? Who are you? Okay, so don't worry. For this next ending, I'm not going to get stuck in a game cartridge, I'm not going to die, and nor is my mum. In fact, everyone is. Because we're going for the nuke ending. So, to be perfectly honest, I'm not exactly sure what triggers this, because it seems to happen somewhat randomly, but it seems like after at least getting one of the endings, there will be a random chance of you finding a golden shell in the ammo box on your truck. If you do happen to get that golden shell and load it into your shotgun, the shotgun turns gold. And if you happen to shoot the sun with that golden shotgun... Alright, this time I promise you, this next ending is going to be a lot better, because we're going for the best men ending. Okay, so for this ending we're going to have to do something a little bit different. Do not shoot the dog. Or the son with the golden shotgun, because we've seen how that goes. But seriously, don't shoot the dog. As hard as it might be, leave him alone. Go through the levels just shooting the ducks. But after level 6, sit down in front of the TV and watch the news report. Tonight on News Channel 6 at 6 o'clock. Police now asking for the public's help in solving the mystery behind the disappearance of several families from the Tri-County area. If you know anything, please pick up your phone and dial 911 immediately. Plus a look at your five-day weather forecast and sports. All that and more... If you look News around the living room again, you'll notice six. that the phone has moved. But you don't need to use it yet. Instead, we need to play one more level and then return to the living room. Yeah, I think it's time we give them a call. So pick up the phone and dial 911. On the non-VR version, just press Q. 911, what's your emergency? The killer on TV. On the news. He's here. Come quick. There you go. No need to worry. They'll be sending their best. For now, to pass the time, just play another level. When you get to round four, the level will end abruptly. But don't worry. You've done it. We interrupt your regularly scheduled programming to bring you a police chase. Officers appear to be closing in on a suspect related to the disappearance of several local families. We're told this person is armed and dangerous. Let's take you overhead now, live to the scene in our Sky 6 helicopter. Uh, it appears we have some kind of bipedal animal running through a neighborhood, some kind of a beast. He's rounding about through a home, right through their backyard, uh, turning a corner, and we want to... Oh, 
Oh, oh, oh no. Okay, uh, officers appear to be neutralizing the suspect. Uh, let's cut through that feed right now. Uh, we apologize for what you just witnessed there. Uh, the suspect was believed to be armed and dangerous, although it appears he is no longer a threat. I know we can count on our county finest to ensure that the suspect is under thoroughly and safely. And Okay, uh, we are getting word now that a press conference is right about to start. The chief of police is going to be speaking out about this matter. Let's take you to him live. I see he's uh, facing the podium. Let's listen in. Um, hello. Um, we're, we're here to discuss the uh, uh, killings in the Tri-County area that uh, have been happening recently. Uh, we have a list of known uh, people who have been killed. Um, we have Alex Knoll, uh, Brandon Lotch, Cameron Bowen, uh, Kevin Comford. Um, we also have uh, Jeremy Crapsey, Nate Ebbing, uh, Nate Sawyer, Chris Sherwood, um, Michael Wyckoff, Spencer Anderson, Spencer Scobland, uh, 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 Chapman Lee, uh, Tiffany Chu, Tyler uh, Nish Nishwa, uh, Heldine Aguiluz, and uh, Jake Watson. Uh, that completes our current list at the current time. Um, we, we will not be taking any questions at the moment. All right, so we got him. Unfortunately, though, the people that made the game are dead, so it's not all good. Next up, we're going for the Fiesta ending. Again, for this one, we have to show some discipline. Once more, do not shoot the dog. Just play through the levels, shooting as many ducks as you can. Ignore the dog, and ignore any news reports suggesting we dial 911. This time, we don't want to do that. The dog's our friend. Play through level 8 up until round 4. If your mum asks you to go to bed, you're in for a fiesta. Honey, it's bedtime. Turn it off. Okay. We can rent it another day since you've liked it so much. But you know, I would have shot that annoying dog. <laughs> oh well. Good night, dear. At this point, you can actually play a little bit more, so if you'd like, you can pick up Final Fiesta 2 and put it in the console. So there you go, there's another ending checked off the list. Grab a couple of maracas and have a party. You've earned it. There's only one more ending to get, and if you check the shelf of trophies in the living room, you'll see that there's one missing. This ending is the dog ending. At this point, getting the dog ending is simple. We just need to try and get the fiesta ending again. So if you go through all the duck season levels, you don't shoot the dog, you don't dial any numbers, you'll once again get the Fiesta ending. 
Only this time, the game isn't so sure about that. Honey, it's bedtime. Turn it off. Okay. We can rent it another day since you liked it so much. But you know, I would have shot that annoying dog. <laughs> oh well. Good night, dear. Something's different. Hmm. Well, here's Final Fiesta. What's this? This time, when you're back in the living room, instead of looking for Final Fiesta 2, look for the tape. When you've got it, do your very best to throw it into the VCR, and then watch. After watching the tape, try and touch the television. We're transported to the stage we've seen quite a few times now, only this time we can roam around. There's a device in the centre of the stage you can actually use. Just hold on to it, and then use it. Again, for the non-VR version, that's Q. It was you the whole time? The dog ending. A nice nod to Silent Hill. You want, you want me to help? Okay. Another lever appears, so if you'd like, you can help him out with the credits. But that's it. That's the seventh and final ending to Duck Season. So, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did and you want to show your support, either leave a comment down below or give this video a like. Either one helps me out a great deal, alright? Once again, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time.